what it's like at the end. So I recorded today. I feel really accomplished because I've uh, been meaning to record a lot of these videos that I uh, haven't had a chance to record. Um, but I want to let you in on a little thing. Like the top up, I have like a cute shirt on. But then the bottoms will be sweatpants. You see what that says? What does that say? You see it? You see it? Don't act like you don't. My little house shoes. I got these from Steve Madden for like 11 I don't think even like $6. Like for Christmas. They were like 15% off the clearance. So yeah, I think these are like 6 bucks, And they're like super comfortable. They're like faux Uggs or whatever. It has like this rubber bottom so I can go outside and get the mail. Hey, what's going on right there? Yeah, it's a whole lot of recording. That's where the magic happens. All that. So recorded some videos today so i feel really accomplished and then i also need to meal prep mm -hmm. i need to do that too so i'm gonna head over there to meal prep and i'm just kind of a little obsessed with uh you know this bright white lip and this hair I'm gonna take it off eventually so meal prep time and as last time i had already done the potatoes earlier today so that's always nice. Just put them in the oven in the middle of the day. You know, I'm not going to eat them right now anyway. I'm going to use them for the rest of the week. So just pop them in the oven for 400 degrees. And it took about an hour, an hour and 15 minutes. The smaller one took about an hour. And the two that were a little bit bigger it took about an hour and 15 minutes. I'm going to do a little chicken this time. Um, I got this chicken from my favorite Trader Joe's, Coyo Asado. And it's really good chicken. So it's basically just chicken strips anyway. So I'm going to uh, cook this up and use this for my meal prep uh, along with some, uh, you know, my brown rice and broccoli and such. So we're halfway there. Uh, so the chicken I just sliced up after I finished pan searing it. I guess you'd call it, I don't know the official term, but it just cooked it in a pan. Uh, I got some broccoli and some spinach, and that's the sweet potato and the rice. And then so I have sweet potatoes and spinach uh, waiting for the tilapia that I forgot to take out. That's now defrosting, but I'm in no rush watching the Oscars. And so I'm going to wait until uh, this defrost so we can cook them up really quickly and then we'll put that in the rest of the Hi Roxy. Say hi. Say hello. Being crazy y'all. She's a crazy, crazy girl. So we got the two tilapia done. That's the lemon pepper, chipotle lime, done. So that's six meals that should last me three to four days um, because sometimes I'll come home and cook something else um, or if I forget it, I get something at work. But for the most part, this is to help prevent me from having to, to get something at work. But Oh, good day, good day. Headed to the gym. I did not get a chance to work out on Monday because we're, we were with my um, job doing the... Uh, science fair for the kids for the children in our region and we also do the state one but we're doing the region one so i had to work late so i did not get to go to train on monday i did a little something at the house um headed to the gym now for a training session with joe and um it's wednesday it's what's today empire wednesday and catfish comes back today yeah this should be really interesting wish all the man of god on the first one too lord jesus um, I'm looking forward to, to seeing the new episodes of Catfish. I hope it goes back to being like kind of, you know, like the, like in the beginning, man, in the beginning, you could just tell these people did not know it was just so much more dramatic. Some of the other seasons is kind of like, oh, it's getting a little redundant. Are these people just faking it? This too much? All that. But, um, yeah. So Empires and Blackish and Catfish tonight. That'll be the TV lineup. <laughs>